Okay, our next uh, electrode material topic is copper tungsten. Copper tungsten can be used to burn steels, but normally our use for copper tungsten electrode material is for burning carbide. The purpose behind it is that the copper tungsten is a tougher material. It passes energy through the electrode material reasonably well, even though it has more resistance. And because of burning carbide, a material that doesn't actually burn, but is held together with a binder of cobalt, we don't burn carbide. Plus being a heavy material, it doesn't evacuate the cavity well. All of this leads to higher wear. We also have to burn it with negative polarity. Now, when burning carbide with copper tungsten, you can anticipate a 20% wear factor for the electrode. So, copper tungsten, in this instance, is our electrode material. If we look at the tip of this electrode, we can see that it's actually been worn down where this tip is at. That's a high wear. The die that it burned is this, and this is a bullet die. The die itself has been polished after machining with EDM. Copper tungsten to carbide. Well, copper tungsten will always be our preferred material for burning carbide. Even though 20% wear factor seems high, it's much lower than any other material you try to burn carbide with. And with the settings that are available on the machines and their generators, you'll always get a good result.